Welcome, Mooncat viewers. This is the daily card reading for April 11th, 2023. I hope you're having a beautiful morning. And if you are one of those who likes to journal along, then this is a good time to open to a blank page and prepare your mind to receive the message. Some people like to watch the card selection and some people don't. If you prefer to skip ahead to the main reading, you can do that using the timestamps in the video. So two cards have come out today, and this is a very interesting thing that has happened. Um, these readings are becoming a bit uh, interesting. <laughs> Let's say they're becoming very interesting. So we have Ace of Wands, but a second card came out today. And the second card that came out today was the World card. Now, just looking at the illustration of the cards, you can see the number 10. How very interesting, because yesterday's card was 10 of Pentacles. Friday's card was also 10 of Pentacles. Here, the number 10 is again reinforced, and to take it further, the world card reinforces the meaning of the number 10. So I'm going to get into all of that um, a bit. So this Ace of Wands, all the Aces are this powerful divine deliverance, like a, a beautiful gift from the divine. We see this winged bunny bringing the Ace in. And the Ace of Wands says that there is, uh, there are new opportunities there is a new direction in work, um, especially with creative work, and that the outcome for this is very auspicious. So this is a wonderful time to take those ideas, the creative ideas that you have, and give them a physical form. So the Ace of Wands is the power and the ability to take the energy or the ideas from the air and bring them into earthly action. Um, actually putting a physical reality to it. And then the very beautiful world card uh, together with that is saying that there is great um, recognition, <coughs> possibly even fame, that comes along with this creative work or this new direction, a new direction for you in work. That it, it, it's something that puts you center stage in a very positive way. We have um, such reinforcement of the number 10 We've had um, one, two, and three occurrences of the number 10 uncanny in those images. Monday's date was April 10th. And then we have the meaning of the world card reinforcing a similar meaning to the number 10. So let's talk about that for a moment. So in numerology, the number 10 represents 
the completion of a cycle in a positive way. The idea here is of perfecting oneself through experience. Um, so it is a successful completion of a cycle of life where you have learned what you needed to learn from the lessons. Mm. So as we grow, as our spirit grows through life, um, we are given lessons that we need to learn. And those lessons will repeat and repeat and repeat until we finally learn them. And then as we do learn what we need to learn from them, we level up and a new cycle of lessons begins. And so this is the phase that you're at right now. And it's absolutely reinforced that there is a new turning, a new cycle. And what we had indicated yesterday is that we're moving from a cycle of strife to this beautiful, wonderful, peaceful cycle of abundance. And here again with the world card that that beautiful peace, that beautiful sense of inner peace is there. That centeredness is indicated in the world card. And so this is well-deserved success coming your way. And this is a change in your life, in your life circumstances or in the way that you go about existing, uh, perhaps like thought patterns and belief patterns changing um, in a much more positive way and finding life to be much more positive, uh, much more peaceful. And so the beautiful thing here is that you're leaving behind all the strife that have has been a recycling lesson for you. So all that strife is completed now as you have learned what you needed to learn from it and you're able to move forward and embrace just a much, a very beautiful life lying ahead. We, we had the Ten of Pentacles twice and to have so much abundance, to have this ace of creative energy, to to have the acclaim of the world card, um, something powerful is going on here. And so for those of you tuning into the daily readings, um, can you feel it? Can you feel that positive energy coming in? Hit that like button because it's a thumbs up sign. Um, hit that like button as a way of saying, I feel that positive energy. I, I embrace that positive energy coming in. Um, there's a lot of excitement in this reading here today, and I hope that you're feeling that excitement too. It's a good time to celebrate life when we see the world card there. And so um, feel that excitement today. Find some small way to celebrate it that, that you can do something that's meaningful and personal to you. Um, find some small way to celebrate. Even if it's just lighting a candle. For those of you who are journaling today, um, looking ahead at life in front of you and what's around you right now, see if you can identify where the excitement is. Where is it coming from? Are you feeling a great positive excitement towards a change in career or home or a new relationship. There have been some readings to indicate that love is in the air. Uh, but mostly just allow yourself to relax and feel the excitement for life and, and know that you have powerful and wonderful changes coming and they must they must be coming quickly because we've had so much reinforcement of this number 10 
that concludes the reading for today. I hope that you are enjoying these videos. And I hope that you are, are feeling this, this great, powerful sense of renewal and excitement for life. I, I hope that, that you're able to tune into that energy. Most of all, I'm just glad that you came by to receive this message today. Thank you for watching, and I hope to catch you in another reading.